Welcome to my channel I aim to upload these news top 10 summaries daily. Links to all articles in the description if one grabs your attention. From Daily Mirror under the main headline of Victoria Beckham, puts family first after sons. Sudden split with girlfriend. Summary of headline article. Victoria Beckham is looking out for her son Cruz. After the teen reportedly split from his girlfriend Bliss Chapman, whose mother Rosemary Ferguson is a pal of the mum of four Victoria Beckham is putting her family first, after her son Cruz split from his girlfriend. According to reports, the couple met through their mother's friendship and so news of the alleged split will no doubt come as shock to all concerned. However Victoria 47. Is said to be. Trying to stay civil. With Rosemary. While. Always putting her son's feelings first. The source continued that despite the couple. Deciding to end things. The Beckhams loved Bliss. Especially Victoria. Someone else said. I can't be the only one uncomfortable with 17 year old Cruz Beckham thirst trapping and stripping to his boxes and showing off abs for a mag front cover. Quote. From BBC under the main headline of Nazanin Zaghari Ratcliffe and Anusha Ashori on way home to UK. Summary of headline article. He said on returning to their home. The first thing his wife wanted to do was sit down on the sofa. Make a cup of tea. And just be in the living room together and that he looked forward to pottering around the neighborhood and be ing normal again. From Reuters under the main headline of both sides in Russia-Ukraine conflict talk of compromise. Summary of headline article. On the ground. The 21st day of the conflict saw more bloodshed as Russian forces besieged and bombarded cities. The United States said Russian forces had shot and killed 10 people waiting in line for bread in the city of Chernihiv. It did not cite evidence of the attack and Russia did not comment on the allegation. Made in a U.S. embassy statement. Ukraine's military said children were among the casualties. This is possible only with a direct dialogue between the heads of Ukraine and the Russian Federation. Podolyak said. From Metro under the main headline of Putin bombs theater sheltering women and kids. Summary of headline article. Mariupol City Council said it was impossible to assess the damage or search for survivors due to ongoing Russian strikes. This is exactly what the Mariupol drama theater looks like now, officials said. Massive Russian attack on the drama theater where hundreds of innocent civilians were hiding. Massive Russian attack on the drama theater where hundreds of innocent civilians were hiding. Dmitro Kuliba said. It tweeted. The Russians dropped a highly explosive bomb just in the heart of Mariupol, drama theater. From Metro under the main headline of West Ham defender Kurt Zoma to be prosecuted for kicking his cat. Summary of headline article. Zoma and his brother are facing prosecution. Picture. Rex. West Ham United star Kurt Zoma will be prosecuted under the Animal Welfare Act after being filmed. Kicking his cat. An RSPCA spokesperson said. Following a full and thorough investigation, we have started the process of bringing a prosecution against Kurt Zoma and Yon Zoma under the Animal Welfare Act. Dagenham and Redbridge FC note the decision of the RSPCA to charge Yon Zoma under the Animal Welfare Act 2006, the statement said. West Ham are in action against Sevilla on Thursday night in the second leg of their Europa League. Last 16 tie. More. Kurt Zoma's brother charged by RSPCA for filming cat kicking video more. Kurt Zoma copycats kicking pets sparks alarm from animal charities for more stories like this. Check our sport page. 
from BBC under the main headline of Earthquake. Japan hit by shock cutting power to millions. Summary of headline article. If you are reading this page and can't see the form you will need to visit the mobile version of the BBC website to submit your question or comment or you can email us at haveyoursay at bbc.co.uk. Please include your name, age and location with any submission. From The Guardian under the main headline of Zelensky invokes Pearl Harbor and 9-11 in plea for U.S. Protection against Russia. Summary of headline article. Wearing his army green t-shirt. With a Ukrainian flag draped behind him. Zelensky was direct. I call on you to do more. We should act like it. Biden has said he speaks to the Ukrainian leader privately nearly every day. But on Wednesday. Before the US president spoke. Zelensky challenged him publicly to do more to stop the bloodshed. On Tuesday, Zelensky had appealed to Canada's parliament and the nation's large Ukrainian diaspora to rally behind his country. The same day, Zelensky acknowledged that Ukraine's long-standing hope of joining NATO was unlikely. From Evening Standard under the main headline of London Sky has a Euro-Orange a Euro tinge is Saharan dust. Cloud sweeps across UK. Summary of headline article. A Saharan dust cloud sweeping over parts of the UK has turned London's sky orange on Wednesday. Among the comments. One person said. Anyone notice the sky over London is a weird yellow sepia colour? So the more layers of dust in the atmosphere the right conditions will give you orange and red tints to the sky. He said the Saharan dust cloud was due to a storm system near Spain. Dust storm heads for the UK 1, 18 dust storm heads for the UK a Saharan dust cloud seen from Waterloo Bridge in London PA a Saharan dust cloud seen from Waterloo Bridge in London PA an orange. Sky is seen over a building in Navarres, southeastern Spain. Monday, March 14, 2022. Earlier on Wednesday, atmospheric scientist Drive Claire Ryder revealed which parts of the UK the Saharan dust cloud would sweep over. From Sky News under the main headline of Boris Johnson doesn't say whether he reached oil deal on Saudi Arabia trip and insists human rights talks will remain private. Summary of headline article. Boris Johnson has declined to say whether his trip to Saudi Arabia will result in a boost to the kingdom's oil production, as he insisted his talks about its human rights record would be kept private. Mr. Johnson has railed against the West's addiction to Russian energy and called on allies to help deliver a further financial blow to Mr. Putin's regime by reducing their consumption of Kremlin-controlled supplies. I always raise human rights issues. As British prime ministers before me have done time after time, he said. But I think you can also see that in spite of that news you've referred to today, things are changing in Saudi Arabia. We want to see them continue to change. And that's why we see value in engaging with Saudi Arabia and why we see value in the partnership. From the Telegraph under the main headline of Watch. BBC newsreader Joanna Gosling overwhelmed with emotion as Nazanin Zaghari Ratcliffe released. Summary of headline article. A BBC newsreader became choked up with emotion as she announced Nazanin Zaghari Ratcliffe's release. From Iran. News presenter Joanna Gosling apologized on air after becoming teary eyed while breaking the moving news that Mrs. Zaghari Ratcliffe is heading to Tehran airport and on her way home. The British Iranian mother boarded a flight out of the country on Wednesday as the UK government settled an outstanding £400 million debt owed to the regime in Tehran. The British Iranian mother is returning to Britain. 
along with a second dual national, Anusha Ashori. Nazanin Zaghari Ratcliffe has been held for nearly six years in Iran and her husband has worked tirelessly to secure her release. Many thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the bell to get your daily notifications. Have a great day. Thank you for your support. Goodbye.